Hi, I'm George. Got Ninja Farm. If not familiar, welcome back to people that have seen these videos. I am trying to get more serious with these videos and share what we're doing here. We're a decade in. Just a little intro to the, the mushrooms here. Uh, we really enjoy what we're doing here. We, we couldn't be happier with it, so we do want to share it to people and try to spread it more. It is a, one solution, one large solution to the symptoms, climate change, to us not living our life correctly in sync with nature, thinking we're above it. Mushrooms. So this is Mushroom Village. We call this 3.0, it's our third version. The first time we got a couple logs from a friend and we watched them. Three years later, I had a tree fall here. I had friends come over, we did a little class on it then, and we inoculated a bunch. That was seven years ago. We're still getting mushrooms from some of them, but they're also breaking down. I may bring a log over and show you that. But we had an, a red oak tree fall here. So I just want to show what we've done with that red oak tree in the process of, of losing it and it falling down as a, a giant mature tree, other than making firewood out of the base of it. We cut and split all the firewood from the base of it. We've taken seven types of mushrooms here and done them in five different ways I believe we'll go over them so we a lot of it was just using a spawn that's in a wood dust and a wood chip I've, I've made videos of these but using inoculating tool for one style for dowels for another style drilling holes uh, doing totems where we, we cut logs into chunks and put mycelium in between about seven to ten inch chunks to cap that we'll take a look at that we also drilled the stump itself Mushrooms are the teeth of the forest. They're going to help break down that stump and process, give us, because those roots go so deep, if it works, we'll get mushrooms back for years and years from that as it colonizes that. So we've got the stump drilled. These are all lion's mane, a pom-pom, and a, oh geez, I'm blanking, a pom-pom and pom-pom and a tufted. We got a lion's mane pom pom and tufted, done in two ways. Well, one way it's drilling it and inoculating it with the inoculating tool, but we've done the logs that are leaning up at a teepee style. We've done the stump itself. And we've also done totems in the back over there. We'll look at those in a minute. Next up, that single log and those two logs over there are an oyster mushroom. We did those. Pretty much the same way by drilling holes but using a dowel that is pre inoculated and waxed and capped those. So, two types of oyster there the, the brown and the golden. Then we get into shiitake, There's two types of shiitake a warm shiitake and a mid range shiitake. And then a uh, chicken of the woods. All those are done log cabin style. Same, we drill the holes, inoculate them, but we stack them log cabin style. We'll wait and look at the totems last. Then here in the foreground, there's a heart-shaped bed. I've done that with straw, with a, a king's trafaria, a wine cap. That feeds more on the ground like that. It'll do real well. I took a straw. I soaked that straw in water for three days to kill any of the competing bacteria or fungus in there. I'm doing the wood chips now to top this off with. Then we put down that wetted straw, a layer of it, dump the King's Trafari in there, the inoculant, the sawdust, cover it up with more saw, more straw. Back here, some of the old totems. You see some shiitake stems sticking out of it, and all the new ones we've done. And this old one here, we can see how it's the teeth of the forest, fungus, had broken that old oak down turn it into soil for us. The whole cycle of life, going from seedling, giant carbon sequestering oak tree, feeding us and the squirrels around us, producing oxygen, to burning that, eating us for a while, feeding us for a while, and right back into soil again. Here's one of those totems, you can see it real well. We've capped it with one or two inch caps on top. And then the layers down through. I think that's probably just about covered all this. Uh, again, please like, share, subscribe. Tell me what else you'd like to see. Peace.